Hey everyone, are you in the real estate space? You have a list of property addresses and all you want to do is to be able to get property details. Maybe you want the Zestimate, rent estimates so you can calculate cash flow. You might need land data or even information on zoning so that you could see if the property could be a potential ADU or not. Well, I've finally made one of my internal tools publicly available. It is the Zillow Bulk Upload Tool. It basically allows you to enter in any list that you have of properties and then what you get back are property details. And this is over a hundred columns of property details that could be really useful for you in your analysis. This applies whether you're an agent, a wholesaler, a real estate investor, you may be getting off market property lists, but you don't have that data to append to it. And I have shown how to get this data previously with Python, but I completely understand that not everyone wants to learn how to code in Python. So I hope that you use this tool, check it out and let me know on feedback. If you're new to this channel, my name is Ariel Herrera, your fellow data scientist with the Analytics Ariel channel, where we bridge the gap between real estate and technology. I am making a huge push right now to move a lot of my internal tools to be public facing. So if you want the latest tips as well as information on when that happens, then please subscribe to this channel as well as like this content if you want to see more tools like this. All right, let's get right into the demo. The Zillow Bulk Property Details web app is a simple tool that allows you to get property details for a list of on or off market properties. Let's try it out with a simple list of properties in Tampa, Florida. Here we have a spreadsheet that contains a list of 100 addresses as well as owner information. However, we need to fill it with property details. Let's go back to the tool and now we can upload our spreadsheet. Once the spreadsheet is uploaded, we can hit submit. This gives us a preview of our file. We can see the number of records, estimated cost, and estimated time to return the data. In order to process the file correctly, we need to map the columns in our spreadsheet to the corresponding address fields. Once that is complete, we can enter our contact information. This is where the file will be sent. Click Submit to go to the Payments page. The Payments page will take you to Stripe. Here you can securely enter in your information. The cost is calculated by a standard $5 processing fee and $0.05 cents for each property address in the list. The tool goes to retrieve property data for each address. Let's take a look at an example. Here we have a property 11226 Springpoint Circle in Riverview, Florida. It's going to grab information on the page. This includes Zestimate and additional features. These additional features include facts and features, interior details, parking, lot, and even zoning information. We can also grab data for price history, and this will all be sent via a CSV file. In only a few minutes, you'll have the CSV file available to download. Once you download it, you'll see all the new columns that are filled for each address. This includes Zestimate, Rent Zestimate, and over a hundred other columns available to use. It is important to note that the tool is only able to retrieve data that's available on the page. In this example, this property does not have information on zoning. However, if we go to this other property, it does have the information available once we pull down to look at property details. We could see lot size dimensions as well as the zoning criteria below. Please make sure you're aware of what data is available for the type of area that you're selecting. I hope you are able to get a lot of value from this tool. Feel free to reach out to me at Analytics Ariel for any questions. And don't forget to subscribe to get the latest on investor-friendly tools. Thanks.